I know this is going to offend somebody to split the room, but Thanksgiving dinner, you can keep it. It is terrible food. <laughs> Truly. Like, do we just eat a pilgrim's dinner just so we're appreciative of the food we have now? Because <laughs> I'll take a bite of turkey and I'm like, I am so thankful for in and out right now. <laughs> I will never complain about that drive through that <laughs> Like, why don't we create a holiday feast around the driest bird in the animal kingdom? <laughs> if something spills at Thanksgiving dinner, I just mop it up with a turkey bag. <laughs> like, isn't it a red flag, the fact you gotta drown this thing in brine for 24 hours? <laughs> just so it tastes like bad chicken? <laughs> That's all turkey is, it's just bad chicken seasoned with sandpaper. <laughs> it's so dry. It's so dry you have to treat it like a shot of tequila and like chase it with a spoon of gravy. Right. Just like... <laughs> it's delicious, Grandma. Thank you. Truly. <laughs> I know I'm not the only one in here because we only eat this food once a year. You know? Like, when was the last time a friend called you in July and was like, hey, I'm making green bean stuffing and we're going to have a random little bowl of cranberry sauce. Come over. <laughs> no. <laughs> Lose my number. We are not friends until you get a barbecue crate. <laughs> Cook hot dogs like an American in July. Man, but it's tradition. And with tradition now, you offend people, especially... With dinner, everybody's food allergies and crazy <laughs> diets. Crazy. I had one cousin who was just like, uh, I'm vegan now, Grandma. You didn't think to make me a tofurkey? <laughs> How inclusive of you. And I have another one who's keto. He's like, I guess I'll just drink butter for dinner. <laughs> There's always one that's way over the top, like has to out diet everybody. And he's just like, I'm on this new diet. It's called the Triceratops diet. I'm gonna need only food from the Jurassic period on the table. Tonight. So start over, Grandma. Thank you. I'm like, whoa, whoa, little foot is not gonna ruin this meal for the rest of us. You know? Play dead for the last dinosaur in your own time. But I still love the holidays. And I'll be honest, I, I get I get sad sometimes because I have family I don't talk to anymore. We're not on speaking terms, you know. They just won't talk to me. <laughs> Ever since we played Monopoly. 